Here it is, the fourth Galapagos Islands video. In order of first appearance in this video are herds of iguanas, sea lions on land snorking with sea lions underwater. Man, those things are like rockets. Enough of this blather, let's get the show on the road. Day three, Friday. No internet, no connection to the outside world. Five more days, five more days. I don't know what's going on in the world. Maybe World War III started, who knows? Because I've got no connection to the outside world. But here, I'm in the Galapagos. And uh, I'm tell you what, it's beautiful. It is, it's really beautiful. The mornings start, morning start out cloudy, overcast, but the, by the afternoon, yeah, it's pretty good, pretty good. But I don't know, this, this is stressing me, man. No, no internet, I mean, what's happening out there? I guess, you know, really it proves to me, I don't need to know what's happening in the world. It doesn't depend on me. do this. We can do this. As usual, I'm the last one to bed and first one up in the morning. Other than the crew, the crew does beat me up in the morning. Similar people doing similar things. From the upper deck of my boat, a view of Isla Española in the Galapagos. sidewalk here.
This path requires careful placement of the foot. <laughs> I'm telling you what. I'm glad for the sand on these rocks because underneath it is wet moss. And uh, one of our group already took a tumble, but he fell well and didn't hurt himself. I don't want to do the same. Baby was nursing, but Mama decided you've had enough. Leave me alone. Oh, come on, Mama. Come on. Sea lines just went wow, right through there like a rocket.
you know that what happened to the albatross, remember they told you that they are just six months here on land. They have to breed in six months. So it's actually the season that is the cold dry season when they have a lot of food here in the ocean. So uh, they are monogamous. Something to think about later is look at the roundness of these rocks. Just tell me they've been tossed back and forth around the ocean for a long time, smoothing them out. But look at the different structure. But look at the fracturing of this rock here. I've, I've never seen anything quite like this, like completely random. All right, something else to check on later. Johan had a picture of this water shooting up here, had an iguana flying through the air. There she blows! I'm just about ready for flat ground again. Dodging these boulders is an exercise for the knees and the ankles. So far, I haven't biffed it, but the day ain't over yet. I see crabs. You see crabs? Let's look down there and see if you see the crabs. Orange. Got water. I guess that's an iguana swimming in there. Yeah. That water is so clear. Absolutely beautiful. Who climbed up there to put that rock up there? That's what I want to I like a smooth path to walk on. <laughs> now, the path is located between these markers. And then you see down there, it says point to the left. I let us get it, and then it says stop. So those are the markings you've got to stay on those paths in the Galapagos. See what it is. What is that sound? Albatross. Huh? The sound? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Albatross. 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 The wave Albatross. Albatross. Okay. The uh, there was an egg right back there, broken. Ah. Yes. A lava lizard is helping the, the sea lion with the flies. The lava lizard gets up there and eats the flies. That's cool. Oh, sea lions, he's out to the world. He must have got a belly full. group from the beach landing in City County. I chose to stay behind. Get a shower, some dry clothes. Second group. Oh, 
Hola. I got to disembarking. <laughs> These guys are great. Casito. 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 Casito.